Oh man, I cannot wait to laugh while watching Chari the Charizard. It's the funniest show ever. Chari the Charizard filmed in front of a cameraman pretending to be an audience. Hi everyone, Chari here, and today I'm going to show you something. One dare I must do is now I'm on the diving board and make sure I won't die while jumping into this pool full of water. Okay, let's get ready. <laughs> oh, Chari, you always know how to make me laugh. The next day. Oh, hey, Dad, what's up? Oh, nothing, Junior. Just watching the funniest show on TV, Chari the Charizard. Oh, mind if I watch with you? Oh, hi everyone, Chari here, and today, rather than doing jokes and stuff, I'll tell you uh, about the story of my life. You see, back in the day, when I was just a little Charmander, my mother died during an accident. I cried and never left her corpse that day. Even when, even when I was not ready to leave, I still... I still stayed beside my mother and then and then the realization happened to me so I took some a part of my mother's bones and but I'm not ready yet to become the become a ground type so, so while I was running away wearing my mother's skull and bones I accidentally bumped into both Pikachu and Buniri Pikachu then shocks me I told both Pokemon that that I was just in a hurry, and and telling them that my my mother died the the day I was born. Then they all they all forgive me and and let let me stay with them. I was feeling ha I was feeling a, a bit of joy that day. Then a few days passed. Now, when I was just a, just a charmeleon, I remembered. I still remembered that day my mother, my mother died. And but then, then recently, my uncle told me that the cause of my mother's death was just by an Aerodactyl. So then I wanted to seek revenge by finding that Aerodactyl, but also tri living. Alongside the Aerodactyl, learning how to survive. Then both, uh, both me and the Aerodactyl faced off in a serious battle. And eventually, I beat the crap out of that Aerodactyl using the Thunder Punch. And when the Aerodactyl fainted, I eventually evolved into a powerful Charizard. Then I went. Then I eventually get to visit the Kalos region to attend community college. And then I also met my friends who are also capable of Mega Evolving. Then after my graduation a few years later, I got my Mega Evolution Stone. Then when I was taking Pikachu and Paniri for a walk, then eventually Hoopa summoned a ring in front of me. And the last thing we know is that we landed on some place with an empty mansion beside us. Now, I don't know anything about owning a mansion, but the one thing we know is that we had to get a job to earn some money. Then we got, eventually we got the money, and we had, we had enough money to own this mansion by ourselves. So now, we are now living free inside a mansion. Okay, that is all I had to say for today. All that I can say is, this is Chari the Charizard signing off. The end. Wow, that was inspirational. Yeah, I, I know Junior, but do you know what makes me interested in this show? What is it? Well, th that has the reason to do with my attitude. 
You see, when I was clearly the king of Koopas, capture when I captured the princess, then <laughs> capturing the princess, but eventually my plan fails. But one day, I fought that Char Charizard alone, and then when I lost to him, he just forced me to watch his TV show. So I agree. So I agree. I quit villainy and spent my entire day in this castle, in my room, watching Chari the Charizard. Okay, Dad, I get it now. Yeah, Monday, one day, you, you can get a TV show that can make you laugh. 